And we're back for another episode of PCW. This is part 7 from our April 20th, 2002 show. And we're going to be coming up here with an exciting match. We've got Eddie Vic versus Max California. This is going to be a match of all ages because these two were longtime friends of PCW, which turned into a uh, rivalry, if you will, a feud that broke out. Uh, you have to watch the other shows to find out uh, what happened and why they turned on each other. Uh, but tonight, uh, this is one of the many uh, throwdowns that we've had between the two. Uh, we've got wise guy uh, Wyatt Connors in the ring right now talking to the crowd, letting him know what just happened. We just happened to see, uh, we just saw uh, Shim Dog versus Fago this last match. And now we've got the one, the only, Eddie Vick coming out. Let's hear it for Eddie Vick. As he uh, doesn't uh, understand how to drink water, uh, most of it just came out of his mouth after he just took that uh, uh, drink there. And if you just saw the man with the, the camera there, that was King Shane getting a ringside view of this match. King Shane with the camera. So if you see him again, uh, everyone say hello to King Shane. Oh, Eddie Vic just spit water on the face of somebody. He just got pee owed. Oh, that, ladies and gentlemen, was real. <laughs> there goes security to go calm him down. <laughs> Eddie Vic just about got his ass kicked by a real fan. That gentleman is pissed off. <laughs> security escorting him over there so he can calm down. <laughs> What an asshole. That Eddie Vic is a real asshole. That fan paid good money to come here and watch our shows. And Eddie Vic just treated him like dirt. Uh, I kind of wish that that guy would have jumped over the ropes and smacked him around. Because he deserved it. <laughs> but good thing security guard Luck was there to save the day. I don't think... Uh, I think that, that guy was a little bit bigger than Vic. Uh, he had about a good... Eight inches on him and uh, 100 pounds. I don't think, no matter how much Eddie Vick is smack talking right now, uh, that it would have done anything. That guy would have pumped him. Uh, but Commissioner Alan Richards coming up here to uh, tell Lady Vick that uh, he needs to stop doing that to our fans. Uh, they need to start treating him right. So let's hear uh, uh, Commissioner Alan Richards bring it down to Eddie Vick in terms he can understand. here tonight. I think if anybody's rooting for anybody to win all this match, it's going to be Pet Max California. Uh, Eddie Vick, uh, I think I think about the entire time he was in PCW, he was a heel. Look at Max California taking a selfie for a guy. Doing a selfie back in 2002 before they were cool. Max California, trendsetter, getting the crowd over there to give the finger to Eddie Vick, and he says, bring it on. You can finger me all the time. That's what Eddie Vick just said, so make of that as you will. There we go, Max California giving some love to the crowd there. Look at that. Crowd favorite as always. Now, <laughs> they absolutely love him. Look at that, getting everybody to give a finger to Eddie Vick. Yeah, only Max California can get the crowd to finger uh, Mr. Vick. Uh, look at that. We got signs in the crowd. We got uh, 
uh, somebody hearts Max California. I can't read the name in that, but uh, uh, there you go. He's showing everybody there, giving it up, giving it to him. Crowd favorite, everybody. Max California. So, uh, I'm going to guess this is going to be probably a five-second match. I'm going to guess uh, Max California is going to just give Eddie Vick a good old spear and give him down to the three count. One, two, three. All within five seconds. What do you think? Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think is going to happen. Because that's, uh, if I were writing the shows, that's how I would have written it. Because Eddie Vick needs to get kicked out of that building. The only person that can clap for you, Eddie, is yourself, as we just saw, because nobody in that crowd is doing it. King Shane is even deep staying away from me. He's going to the opposite side of the ring. He knows that uh, you uh, spitting that water around is no good for our cameras. So give it up to King Shane for thinking ahead and staying away from the uh, uh, greasy, wet, slime ball Eddie Vick. And uh, look at that. Crowd is just still giving it to him. Max California is going to win by a popular vote, that's for sure. Uh, if Max California were to run for office, he'd win. So everyone's getting uh, ready for the match. Uh, Max California uh, uh, giving the stink eye to Wise Guy Wyatt Connors. Now, that's something I don't know if I can stand behind because Wise Guy's uh, one of my brethren, you know. Got an announcer, got a commentator. He is the wise guy. He is the best in PCW. But there we go. The crowd's still loving it for Max California. The match should be underway, but the crowd just will not settle down. We have a capacity-filled crowd here tonight. Eddie Vick is even too afraid to get in that ring with Max California. He's been walking around the skirt all night. And he's still, there we go, finally we're getting inside the ring. Finally, Eddie Vick has found the courage to stand inside the ring with Max California. You know, it just wasn't too long ago when these two were friends. I think Eddie Vick's probably thinking back by that, thinking maybe, uh, maybe he shouldn't have said those things. Maybe he shouldn't have done that thing or whatever it was to drive those two apart because they used to be best friends. And look at that, he's no match for Max California. I tell you what, Max California's arm is just as thick as Eddie Vick's thigh. That guy has no chance coming up. I, he needs to just run out right now. Look, we got a grapple. We got a grapple. Max California again forcing Eddie Vick into the side, getting too smart for him, letting him run into the ring post himself. We got punched to the face, punched to the face. Eddie Vick trying to do it, but no! Slam down to the ring. Max California giving it to Eddie Vick. He had to get the hell out of that ring because he just did not know what was happening to him. Trying to catch his win. We got only a 10 count out there. I don't think 10 seconds is going to be enough to catch your win, Eddie Vick. There we go. The referee, Mason, counting up. We're already up to 7. We're up to 8. We're at to 9. And there we go. Right just a split second before being counted out, he finally found the gusto to step back into the ring with Max California. Not too many people would uh, would do this. Oh! Quick low shot. I think that was below the belt. Kidney kick. Another kidney kick. Another kidney kick. And he's pulling him up by the hair. Max California here got just blindsided by Eddie Vick with some dirty moves. So now Eddie Vick's in control of this match for the moment. But only for a moment. There we go, climbing up the, the ring ropes, and we got a choke hold with his boot. We got a small size seven trying to choke out uh, Max California. I don't think those size sevens are gonna quite do it. <coughs> oh, punch to the face. Watch that referee, Mason. Tell him to open up those, those fists. No closed fists in PCW. There we go, and oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Oh, eight punches, and that's enough. Max California says, I'm going to powerbomb that because eight punches equals a powerbomb. <laughs> we have... <laughs> that's PCW math, ladies and gentlemen. We have Max California back in control again, and he better stay in control because Eddie Vick... Well, you know what? Even if Eddie Vick somehow miraculously wins this match... He's not going to make it out of this, this ring because that crowd is going to storm him. 
That crowd is not going to let Betty Bick walk out of this ring. I tell you, they are hating him. They are being so loud, booing him as Max California is in control of this match. He's going to stay in control as we grapple up. He looks like we got it ready for a suplex. Snap snoop, suplex. Snap snoopplex almost. And one, two, and two and a half only. I thought that was it, folks. I really thought that was going to be the end of the match. Because it's Eddie Vick versus Max California. And Max California always wins. Well, that's the way I remember. Let's see if uh, I'm remembering correctly. Because we've got 12 years going on here since this match has happened. If anyone you see Max California out there, stop him, talk, get an autograph from him, see if he remembers this match of giving it to Eddie Vick right before the crowd almost gave it to him. Two count again. Max California just had Eddie Vick down, only able to get a two count. Referee Mason letting him know it was only a two count as Mason there is watching closely on hand to make sure that everything is on the up and up because we got King Shane there grabbing the action. If I were to miss something... I got the second camera there to back me up. And King Shane is the king of all footage. And Eddie Vick doing another dirty move, pulling the top rope down. So Max California just took a tumble to the outside cement. He just landed on that cement, ladies and gentlemen. Cement. We have no pads there in PCW. That is the hard cement. And Max uh, California just hit that. Referee Mason couldn't even believe it. He had to tell the people there what just happened. Uh, we needed to possibly get some medical attention over there, but it looks like uh, things are still going. Uh, we've got uh, mayhem on the outside of the ring. We've got the cameraman following the guy in white shirt back there for some reason. As the action takes place on the other side of the ring, we didn't see exactly what happened, but I'm going to guess Max California got hit and thrown into that, uh, that uh, corner post there, that solid iron and steel corner post that uh, is holding our ring together. And uh, he just did it again. Uh, back to the corner post. Eddie Vick trying to destroy the back of Max California. Commissioner Alan Richards is not liking this. He is just about got him out for a 10 count. Eddie Vick rolled quickly into the ring and got back out to reset the count. <coughs> Commissioner Alan Richards is on hand to, uh, to watch as as Max California reverses that Irish whip and throws Eddie Vick into the turnbuckle, Max California pulls the trick just out of Eddie Vick's bag and rolls into the ring to reset the 10 count just to give him a suplex onto the cement. That rock hard, cold cement just got pounded to Eddie Vick's back with that suplex. And with that, Max California's last said, I'm going to take in the trash instead of taking it out and throws it back into the ring. We're getting trash thrown around here, folks, as we're getting the, uh, the steel chairs thrown around. Steel chair in the ring. I don't know where that came from. Max California saw that steel chair, and I think he's going to try and do a big super kick to Eddie Vick. Eddie Vick just got his neck rammed down with a super kick on the back of his neck for Max California. Max California is taken to A. Vic and just got a low blow to the family jewels. The crown jewels of California just got hoodwinked by A. Vic. A. Vic is going down somehow. He manages to lift Max California for a body slam. And a the elbow to the gut from Eddie Vick to Max California. Another elbow to the gut. Eddie Vick is taking it to him with the steel chair in the hand. This, my friends, had better not be what it looks like. Eddie Vick has that steel chair in aiming. And Max California ducks just to have... Well, referee Mason get hit. Get hit by the steel chair. <coughs> we have the referees out. Mayhem's going on. There's nobody to stop 
Eddie Vick. Oh, except for Max California. We all forgot Max California was in the ring. He was there to stop Eddie Vick from doing that. And since Commissioner Alan Richards is on hand for this show, he is a board-certified referee. He can take the place of Mason if need be. We are not without uh, an official because, as I said, Commissioner Alan Richards is a board-certified referee. He, he has passed the referee schooling within PCW. Oh, I should hope so because he probably actually commissioned the, the, the referee school. And I'm sure he even created the test. So he probably even passed himself. That is not a conflict of interest. That is, that is just the way that companies are run. Everybody's doing it. It's, it's state law. State law. So we have an official on hand, folks. Don't you worry. Uh, photographer uh, Amy is actually a nurse uh, by day. So she is tending to uh, referee Mason's needs to make sure that he doesn't need any more severe medical attention. So Eddie Vick, if you just notice, setting up for... Uh, his uh, finishing move to Max California, but uh, he did not want to give the crowd what they wanted, so he's he is taking Max California's move and giving it to Max California <coughs> and slamming him down. The California Nation, Commissioner Alan Richards, only getting at a two count. As you can see, his perfect and proper form of counting had only gotten to a two count. That right there is a model of how all referees can count. And Eddie Vick is trying to show Commissioner Richards he doesn't agree with his count. But Commissioner Richards is a board certified referee, whereas Eddie Vick is not. So I'm gonna have to test Mr. Allen Commissioner Richards as Max California does a scissor kick flying through the air, a 360 scissor kick, bringing Eddie Vick down, and it looks like Max California snaps suplex again, and he is calling for his finisher. King Shane getting right in there for the action, because we all know Max California, there he's setting up for his finisher, setting up for the California Nation, and he's gotten Eddie Vick down, Commissioner Richards. One, two, three. That's it, folks. Three count. One, two, three. That's that's right. <coughs> Max California just took home the win, and everybody there was probably expecting that. And everybody there is as happy as they can be because Eddie Vick just got shown what was coming to him. Commissioner Alan Richards. There to take over for Mason, the referee, since Eddie Vick cold cocked Mason with a steel chair. So Eddie Vick just got what's coming for him. Wise guy Wyatt Connors is not too pleased about what happened, but the crowd loves it. Max California loves it. Referee Mason loves it. Commissioner Alan Richards, even though he's impartial, I know that he loves it deep down. Uh, I think uh, Eddie Vick uh, is it still laying in the middle of the ring as Max California does his victory walk around. High five the crowd, giving some love. And since Max California is giving love to the crowd, I think you all should give some love to this video. Throw down a like, show me that you love it. Let me know that you want to see more of these shows coming up as we dive into the archives of PCW. This is basically going to be PCW on demand. This is 12 years in the making, almost 15 years in the making for some of these shows. And we got now here in YouTube here in Bankers, Max California walks off into the sunset, waiting to buy all these things. Well, stay tuned for another episode of this show coming up. Thank you, YouTubers.